Hello! My name is Tailbrex. So we are all going to play RimWorld. Yeah, RimWorld. Ah, oh, it's been a while. <coughs> it's been two days later. Let's start this game. So I just actually bought my webcam again. Another Okay, let's do this. So... Now... Let's slow the game. Wait, 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 wait. Just wait. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Oh, come on. Come on. Wait. Alright. What does... What does this not work? Ah. Oi. 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 Oops. What the... What the hell? Uh, nobody cares. Everybody cares. Fucking. Everybody. Raiders and Wimbledon have one primary goal. Cares. Raiders love furniture, and if they come to contact any, they will What the? With that in mind, why not abuse it? Put furniture within range of your turrets or places where your power can fire upon the enemy. You could also even landmine the crap out of that area. Come on. Wait. Wait. Oh, why is this too long? Why is this too long? Give it a shot. It's a good, very good method to destroy the raiders without having to really touch them very much. There. Be mindful of where you choose hmm. to land. The location of your colony is going to ultimately shape the type of no. you want to create. So no. No. Uh. Okay, you're probably going to land in a separate forest. Okay. This, this is, is shit. Let me load the game. So I play uni Union of Ob Fenbia. Fenbia. Okay, let's play. Ooh. That's a good idea for play. Okay, it's been a while. Let's play. But doing this will definitely make the game much more interesting for yourself and much more difficult. It's kind of like a difficulty setting. I mean, since there already are difficulty settings in this game, but I mean, the climate in itself is basically a difficulty setting in Rim World. So anyway, give it a shot. On to tip number four. So, be mindful of the weapons your column is used. Certain weapons are better for different purposes. For example, sharp weapons are much better for slashing enemies, for taking off limbs, and making them bleed. Sharp weapons include things you would expect, like knives, swords, axes, etc. Okay, there. Alright. Minor break risk. What the hell? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh oh, he is feeling stressed. Now, here's my red pandy. Did I tame? Mm, yes. Wait, there's a kidney! I just harvest my kidney. Steve wants a kidney. Pick up the kidney. Pick up. Let's check in inventory. How much did he get the kidney? <laughs> I got the kidney. Dudes. That's good. Uh, making kidney. Here's this Skiver Skyver's dead for 5.1 days. That looks like a long time. Health. Health. Sight 100%. Use your heavily armored colonists to block the enemy. Okay, right, if you happen to have some really good armored colonists, use them. Combine really heavy armor and a well, and a tight together, and you're almost guaranteed to kill the enemy. If you can, Recreation variety? Chemical consumption? This colonist should be able to take most of the damage, no problem. If not, then at least I guess they tried. If you have a one no one wide entrance to your yeah. colony, just okay, stick so them around there with a melee weapon. They should be able to distract the enemy long enough for you for your tank columns not only deal a good amount of damage to them, but your other columns. Drink. Let me drink. Please drink it. Come on. Drink coffee. Wait. A melee column Much. is going to be charging through gunfire to slash the enemy, mm. so a shield bow is extremely important because it Come stops on. the bullets hitting you. Beware though, the shield does not stop melee. And that's when your column's armor comes into play. 
But snow let's make chaos create snow using caffeine overdose. Let's overdose him on caffeine. Let me overdose him. So, items sitting around outside will mock, mock. Mm -hmm. because they're mm -hmm. not inside. So what you need to do is go around them, roof the area, and BAM! They're no longer deteriorating. There are some resources that aren't affected by them, however. Things like stone chunks and dirt. Those are prime examples of items that are not affected by being outside. But He's gonna get 100% caffeine. There, he's full of caffeine. Uh oh, Mitsuya is no longer incapable of walking. Uh oh, I'm afraid. Wait, what is that lowest comfortable temperature? Oh, we're negative 10. That's enough. Okay, so. Wait, what's this? Ah, raw devil strand. This is very good. It is very important. So, Jimmy needs. What's the temperature? Lowest. Jimmy. Jimmy. Stra mood. Uh oh, low mail. Okay, so creation. Uh. Don't make that mistake. If you have only one colonist capable of doctoring, you're bound to fail. Okay, that so early on, avoid What's having any disabilities in your college. If you're recruiting prisoners, be mindful of who you recruit. Disabilities so could make or break your colony. No. A common error among new players Let's is just recruiting every prisoner they can, can find. While no, having no. more colonists is Cancel. usually better. If that colonist isn't capable of doing most things, then they're practically useless and they're just another mouthful. So those are my 10 tips no. to help you guys out in the world. I really Wait, hope you guys enjoyed this it? video. I put a lot ah, it's gonna fully grow. Let's wait so a long time before it grows. My server, which, by the way, okay, let's the mine. Server, the link is in the right. description. Put mine. That it's a good time. But thank you to them for helping out. To mine. I gathered around these tips and everything. And I just compiled it all together and put it in my own words. But thank you guys so much for what you guys did. It means so uh, much to me. Good. I love you all. Is it full of caffeine? Uh oh, he must drink. Drink iced coffee. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There, good. He's full. He's full of caffeine. He's extremely caffeinated. Okay. Let's see. We'll Come on, money, mine, mine. There. Good. Good. Let's mine more. There are so many things that can go horribly wrong from simple mistakes. It's insane. So, this video came to mind, and here we are. That's terrible. Not to do in real life. That's good. To start off, we're going to be talking about ancient ruins and why it's super safe to open it. Just go up to one of the ruins, right when you start the game, and you can tell the wall. You'll be welcome. Mm. Well, How much? How much caffeine get? Ah, uh, 97? Oh, things, no, 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 things no, 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 soon. No, 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 no. The plants would grow for a long time. Wait, where's our? Where are my plants gone? Ah, this? Come on. Okay, it's almost there. I'm gonna fully grow. they grown up. And they're harvesting. Good. They're harvest. Ready to harvest. Isn't it cool? We can, power we can harvest plants. We can actually it's harvest. So much power. Come on. Okay, I can see their plant. <gasps> Mofalo. I tamed Mofalo. Some Mofalo. Can I just fight some animals? <gasps> Org revenge. Oh, okay. Okay. Doesn't care. That doesn't matter. 
the Sudan. That's enough, and then let's stop recording. Stop.